Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here one and only, and today we're gonna to be playing Mutant Year Zero, Road to Eden. So I've been looking forward to this game for quite some time now, and I actually get to try it out. It is a strategy game. At first, I guess everybody thought it was gonna be like a first-person shooter or something like that, but it's not. It is a strategy game, and I am so happy to get into it just because the developers were actually nice enough to send me a key. And we're going to try it out, and this will probably be a series. Um, I'll probably start this series up on my... Well, I'll probably try and finish the game on stream instead of, like, recording it so you guys can experience it with me and, you know, chill and hang out. Talk about the game. But the series will be uploaded to the channel since we've basically finished The Conjuring House and finished that. Without further ado, let's get in. Let's take and see if we have subtitles and stuff on. Ah, uh, there it is. Okay, it is on. Good, good, good. Alright, graphics are on medium. Alright, all the right settings. Let's, let's go down just a tad. And with that done, we're gonna go in. See how it is? Alright, so there is normal, hard, very hard. So let's see, if you are new to the Town Tsuku game, enemies will do less damage, stalkers regenerate all HP after combat, abilities are reset cooldown after, okay so you have to plan more if you were to go into hard. I mean I have experience but not with this type of game though. Oh there's permadeath too. Oh dear god, no manual saves, only auto saves after each turn. Dear god, now that would be a challenge. I want to go on normal though. What does this look like if you're going on very hard? God, I want to see somebody do this on very hard. And are in mutant. That would be quite interesting. If I'm going to go for insanity's sake, I'm going to go on there. <laughs> Very interested in the story, so let's get into it. So if anything, this would probably be like in at least an hour ep uh, episode, uh, depending on how long the game is. Another day, another mission, risking our so, next for So yeah, the hold on. You know, I ask myself, Ducks, why are you out here? And you know why. The Ark's water pump is broken again, and Hammond said he needs more scrap to fix it. Yeah, well, we'd do it a lot better if he'd sent us somewhere with actual scrap to find. Why do you have to be so annoying? Come on, we gotta head back before Prep closes for the night. Alright, so that's pretty much how the dialogue's gonna go. I mean, I am really interested in the story, too. So, let's go here. So this is the move around gameplay, huh? I can just explore around. Am I even going the right way? Definitely not going the right way. I'm just doing my whole gamer thing. <laughs> looking around. So I can turn off my flashlight. Oh, and it turns into stealth. Okay. So is anything even over here? Okay, it doesn't look like it. So we do have scrap at the top. Yeah, healing. I'm guessing that's ammo, and the other one, Trust the me, second one, is annoying. like nades. Shut the hell up. Want to see annoying? I can show you annoying. What's wrong with you? We're in the zone. Keep your eyes open and mouth shut. Yeah, you only told me that nine thousand times already, Borman. Okay, so holding that tells me which way to go. Well, one thing I can say is, Duck reminds me of Daffy Duck for for sure. He's, he sounds like a evolved version of Daffy Duck, like a mutant version, <laughs> for sure. And this could be Porky the Pig, you know, a little bit of like cartoon humor. Look at this, beautiful, just beautiful. This scrap's gonna make us heroes back at the Ark. 
Oh, so I can hide him? So I, how would I unhide him? Stay back, guys. Come on. All right, so how do I change characters? Uh, whoops. What the hell is this? Oh, I clicked into something. <laughs> okay, so they have... Um, Majors, minors, and passives. Bonus stats are permanent and always apply, regardless of loadout. If you guys are wondering what's behind me, it's only that stuff. Okay, so I can build these guys a way I see fit. But does it doesn't seem like they go into too many, like, new things? Noted. So if I push C, it goes into that. Alright, let me look at the controls, because I, I hit him, and I don't know how to get him back. Previous character. Okay. It was, uh, L. L shift. Left shift. Not just any mutants, stalkers, tight muscles, good meat. I smell it too. Where there's stalkers, oh. there's arc. Where there's arc, there's killing time for schizics and treble. Look out! They're close, close, close. Okay, so. Come back at turn base, each stalker gets two. Action points, okay. Some extra points, such as shooting, throwing, will end your turn once used. Okay, so this is going to be interesting. Uh, <laughs> Marauders, Butcher. I'll spend two action points if I move here. Okay. So I have a 75% chance of hitting. Nighty night. <laughs> Well, come, brother. I'm on that trail. Wait, is there another one? I hear him moving over there. He doesn't know that his brother's dead yet. Oh, okay, we're controlling. Whoops. So full cover gives me more defense, okay. Flanking a cover position will be cancelled. Okay, so if somebody gets around, they can cancel my uh, defense bonus. Well, that's his unfortunate. So, 50, 50 chance of hitting. Screw it, let's go for it. Ah. Oh. Well, I should have known I have no luck in video games. What what am I doing? <laughs> I actually thought I was gonna hit that. <laughs> yeah, right. Oh, I'm out of range. Crap. I don't even have a nade. Um, uh, I could hold or rotate the camera too. All right, cool. Uh, too bad, dude. 
No ammo. Wait, what? Oh no. Reload. Okay, now shoot. We're good. <laughs> In your face. <laughs> okay. I definitely like the I've gameplay so far. This far south before. They're getting closer to the arc every day. Something's up, Borman. Buddy? Oh, hold up. So a damage bond, so I can put that on the weapon? So I have a chance to burn enemies and a chance to add additional crit damage. Okay, so there's loot. Yes, loot. I love loot. Hopefully they're all randomly generated. That'd be amazing. Alright, buddy. Let's go. Oh, so if I turn on a light, it actually um, lights up the area. Yeah, that's actually pretty neat. Oh, I can use toggle to change between them too. So what are we going? We're going that way? Hold up, let's look for loot before we... Before we miss out on some things. So you can set up like your own strategies and stuff, like ambush enemies solo by themselves. If you're strong enough to um, one-shot them at least. And Duck seems to be really good at it. At assassinating without making noises. So he seems like our silent killer, our silent assassin. Pretty nice. So there is no running, from what I know. So there's no sprint. But let's double check that. Is there a sprint? Okay, no, I was right. There is no sprint. Oh, we can investigate this. Good thing we didn't. That's Miss it. that. We saw one of these things once, filled with zone dogs, right? Oof. The ancients sure knew how to build big pieces of garbage. How dare you? Planes were amazing back then. I never rode in one. I, I'm gonna try and milk that as long as I can of not riding in one, <laughs> riding in one. But still, they're cool to watch other people in. Not, not myself. So damage modifier. Can I put that inside of uh, my weapons right now? Or is that only for him? Okay. So first off, where, where is my mod? Did I not pick it up? I guess I didn't. I just can't use it right now. Or it's not something I can just automatically use on the field. Oh damn! What the hell is that? Yeah, no. Got ourselves some ghouls. One of them looks like he ate a ghoul. We better get into ninja mode. Listen, turn off your flashlight. If we sneak by the water, they won't see us. Oh. Avoid the red skull. Avoid red skull enemies. Export is owned by the. Okay. I will rip up their tiny stalker arms and beat their faces till they die! Holy crap, Fist level 50. Huh? No one loves a stalker. Give me the stalkers. Let them come. If someone beats them on the first try, I will oh, praise you. <laughs> Screw that. I am Audi. 55? Dude, like I said, if somebody actually beats those two, I, you are amazing. <laughs> Without cheats, okay? Without cheats. But I don't know. If you guys want this as just a YouTube series or as a stream series, do let me know. Because it does get like different vibes either way. Because mostly I'll be talking with chat and chat will Home's be reacting to my gameplay too. Oh, I'm going to kiss that elevator when I see it. Get upstairs, take a bath, get a grog with the boys. 
Get another grog with the boys. Foot massage. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be great. All right. Let's just see if we can make it there, okay? But yeah, I'll have chat up on the screen so that you guys can see their reaction to it as well. So, whichever one you guys want, I will actually do. I guess I'll put up a, like, a poll inside of the um, community tab and we'll see from there. The campsite. Looks like a family lived here. Lived here and died here. Nothing like a bunch of skeletons Damn. to put your mind at ease. First aid. Good thing nobody got hit so far. But with me controlling it, everybody's gonna die. <laughs> it never ceases to amaze me of how many times I've gotten myself into trouble. It's fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it. We got this. I thought that bag would have something. So you probably want to look around everywhere for like uh, loot for sure. Just because if you miss loot, then that just that just means you're a bad explorer. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But if you miss loot, yeah, you're you're definitely gonna miss out on some scrap. And I I feel like scrap could probably be currency. Maybe I could be There's wrong. There's a cabin up ahead. Definitely feel a ghoul vibe coming off of it. So we run in, guns blazing. Too dangerous. If we're sneaky, we can get into a good position. A good position keeps us alive. Turn off your flashlight. Well, he's not wrong. Okay, so there's basically a little bit of stealth, too. Let's see if I can actually pull this off. That's a real question there. I've always been great at stealth games. As my chat. Hungry, hungry. I guess we take the arc. Tasty mutants. <laughs> Love me some mutants. And we go. Rip their hearts. Crush their. Hey, hey. Whoa, okay, yeah, don't do that, okay. Alright, so let's see, you have the most HP, which I want to get you out first. Alright. Activating this will engage into combat, ignoring it will allow you to keep it hidden same location okay yeah let's activate combat Ooh, um, if only I had a nade so I could talk in between both that won't kill though <laughs> well then that had to hurt well it did definitely did Yeah, I should have been in a better position, for sure. Uh, let's go right here. Are you kidding? What? Oh, come on. Well, that's unfortunate. Wait, what? <laughs> I wonder why we don't get subtitles. Yeah, I'm wondering why we don't get subtitles for um, the actual battlefield. Yeah, get out of here. Drop your loot. Oh, man, you are the shit. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, can I actually? Please let that be a thing. Ah, crap. I, I just realized that I lost most of my stuff. I'm high. Hello. Wait, what? Are you kidding? Oh, ah, fine. Fine, game. My bad, dude. Wait, do I have to reload every time? Okay, no, I don't. Okay. God damn it. Alright, I just need to... Um... I see that that doesn't work. <laughs> I should have just killed him. It's kind of my fault, though. Oh, Pretty sure he has to come out here just to hit me. Of questions. Better. There you go. That'll make you better. All right. Instead of um, doing that, we're gonna get right here. I was gonna reload, but it'll be smart for you not to. God damn it! Reload. All we gotta do is kill him. Serves Take it nice right. and slow. Not like reckless and just. Oh. Overwatch. Okay, so Overwatch, basically, if you guys don't know, I, I definitely know about that. Overwatch is basically hey, buddy, where you. if you cross their path, they'll attack you. Thank you. We wasted so much of our materials. <laughs> yep, and that's why I meant. Overwatch. Overwatch. I was to say that shouldn't hit me at all, bro. Help. Stay right where you are. It's the next turn. If anything, um, Overwatch. go to Overwatch. We're gonna go over. Oh, he's gonna definitely hit us. <laughs> no way in hell he's not. Let's force him over here a little bit. Yeah, there we go. That's what I'm after. Now, he's not in Overwatch at all. Which is good for us. Goodbye, dude. <laughs> okay. Wasn't the best... <laughs> Wasn't the best match, you know? <laughs> oh. Okay, hold up. If you're talking to level up, you gain mutant points. Mutant points can be unlocked and mutant points can be used to unlock powerful combat mutants. Okay. Nice. Chest. Give me the loot. Oh. Can destroy cover. Also knock back enemies. Oh, we're taking it. So is the loot like um fate? That's what I want to know. If you guys have never played Fate, it's basically the um Oh. I was gonna say it's basically like um Torchlight. Where you have to manage your inventory. I should have just said Torchlight, because most people know Torchlight, if anything. Uh run and gun. 
after using your second action, your body can trigger a burst of stamina, allowing you to perform the action afterwards. Okay. Or I can increase my HP and make him more of a tanky unit. Duck isn't really too tanky, he's just more of like, hey dude, I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> We're definitely grabbing this. I would love the HP. I kind of want to build into that right now. Allows you to fly. Flying could probably be really good, but I want to go into HP next if we have the points. Oh, we do have the points? Wait, hold up. Okay, just making sure I was about to say, hold on. Hold on a second. Is Are we sharing points here? I was about to say. Uh, let's go for this first, and we'll get that next. Because I have a feeling I'm going to have to get in way closer Coming. with some of these enemies. Alright, we got weapon parts. Alright, any of the loot I've missed yet? These are artifact points, so great. No Look okay. at this beauty. The ancients left a lot of ugly junk behind, but once in a while you see something like this. Wonder what these buttons are for. I wouldn't touch it if I were you. I'm not kidding around. Lay off the buttons. What's up your butt? <laughs> That's a bomb. Oh, I can actually right? climb up this? They used to call it a boom box. Touch that red button, and it goes boom. Don't be pretending you know what any of this crap really? is. We'll bring it back to the ark and show it to Prim. Ask him what oh, it's for. I want to slide down. I'm about to say, please don't let me lose HP off that. That would suck. But, yeah, it's actually pretty interesting that it's pretty much futuristic and they don't know much about us, so they call us the Ancients. So, yeah, that's going to be that's gonna be quite interesting in the story, because then we get to see how they see us from, like, the past or from, like, the future. Now, I feel like I'm personally attacked. Talking about me. How dare you. <laughs> Things just don't make, like, actual boom box to go boom. Not all the time. <laughs> Not all the time. Oh, yeah, I just realized we lost all of our heals to that one combat. Oh, well, you're going to be getting a lot of that until I actually get everything down now. Because I've never played XCOM. I didn't... Of around the time they the came out, I didn't really did have the money us. for it and stuff like that. When the ice melted, you said nothing. When the plague spread, you did nothing. When the nukes dropped, you became nothing. At least that's what the Elder says. But cheer up. You'll be happy to know that despite your mistakes, life remains. In a small settlement high above a raging river, people are living and thriving. We call it the Ark. Okay. The Ark is humanity's last outpost. A lonely island in an ocean of chaos. Within these walls, we help each other create a new civilization on the ruins of the old one, with the guidance of our leader, the Elder. The Elder tells us we're safe as long as we never leave, because outside these walls lies the zone, the never ending wasteland. 
spanning the planet, littered with your crumbling monuments to your hubris and arrogance. What the Elder chooses not to tell us is our food and water supplies are running dangerously low. That's why he relies on stalkers, adventurers who leave the Ark, explore the zone, and scavenge for precious resources. Stalkers are tough enough to resist the rock, and they got the smarts and the firepower to keep the zone ghouls at bay. Stalkers have to be more than human. That's me, Mr. More Than Human, a.k.a. a mutant. I look weird to you, but hey, you look weird to me. So let's leave it at that. <laughs> if the stalkers come back from the zone alive, the Ark survives another day. If the stalkers don't come back, the legacy of mankind will be lost forever. At least, that's what the Elder says. All right. Still feel personally attacked. How dare you? <laughs> but pretty cool. So far, first impression is that it's actually going to be really difficult and challenging. And pretty damn fun. Hey, let's go to the level 25 zone. That's, that sounds like fun. <laughs> so we got one more zone into the arc. I think that's where we'll end it once we get there. Sweet home. The elevator's up ahead. Yeah, but you don't know if enemies are like near your home now. Okay, so I can hide past that door. A lot of hiding spots. Whoa. So if we were. Hold up. Got two ghouls hiding over there. I think they want to hitch a ride on our elevator. Forget that. Let's sneak around and see if there's any others. Alright, so far we don't see anyone else. Oh. Your flashlight lights up blue. From what I see. You go from a top down position that is locked when you go into here. Come on, looking good. Damn, dude. <laughs> Adds range to your gun. That that would be really nice right about now. <laughs> Alright, so if you guys want to read that, uh, you're more than welcome to. I'm going to go back and read it during the recording. So, yeah. Pretty much a thing I'd love to do. Just so you can get more gameplay time. Just because I don't try to edit too much of my playthroughs. Try to keep it all natural. Box opens. We go in the box. So there's I don't trust Box those propane tanks. We kill them all. <laughs> Alright, so the good thing is we can go in here, put this stuff on. Oh, it actually shows the designs. Nice. I like that. Does it actually have age? Okay, no. That's actually pretty cool. Oh, you can give anybody a different weapon. Oh. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Interesting. I can give you the shotgun if I wanted to. Alright, that's actually pretty neat.
so my enemy heard me. But I am still stealth. Which means I should just uh wait off. <laughs> Nailed it. All right, good. It's still funny that you think three of you can take the arc, though. Damn, bro. Through the car? Not that bad. Oh yeah, I'm definitely not moving on that. What do you, what do you think this is? Alright, so I can't chase anybody out there because I am out of range. If I was to move here. Alright, so he's still out of range too. What, you can still hit me for that range? Dude, you need to give me your gun. Like, that's what I need, is your damn gun. Like, jeez. Holy crap. I gotta have to move out of here. I can't keep letting them, um, hit me like that. What the hell? Game. What? Uh, okay. I wasn't trying to move. I just pushed space. And I guess space wherever... I guess they put the cursor is where you move. Overwatch. Overwatch. Was out of range. Sorry about that. You did it, kid. Right, so if I want to sprint, I'm gonna sprint over here. He's up on my points. Oh, so you can't shoot through things. That's how they've been hitting me. You would a bitch of BS. Overwatch. Overwatch. Hey, dude, nice cover. Guess what I can do? Oh, well, hold on. <laughs> Let me reload. That's what I can do. Guess what I can do? No chance to. Okay, all of a sudden I have no chance of hitting. What the hell, man? Overwatch. I was hoping you would miss. Well, let's just hope that uh, we can carry it out. Well, that sucks. Crap, we gotta go to our side. Oh, well, that's unfortunate for sure. Overwatch. Really? Come on, duck. Well, that doesn't put us in a good position, so he's probably gonna die now. Ugh. Well, I wanna see what happens if he dies. Do I automatically. Well, it 
Said no permadeath. I got achievement called my bad. <laughs> but that's fine. Oh god, these positions. Yeah, I'm gonna have to move. This is probably the worst position for me to be in, for sure. Okay, I didn't see this ladder at first. That kind of sucks for me. If I would have had this ladder, everything would have been, like, way easier for me. Can I not go up the ladder? Okay, yeah, I can. I have to scroll up. <laughs> I figured. I totally figured. I'm okay. I'm okay. Is that how you were hitting me, huh? With the freaking scope, <laughs> you piece of shit. Uh, hey guys, come on, buddy. Come here. Regroup. Let's go. <laughs> what a jerk. Split up. Like I said, I haven't really Coming. played this game, like, too much. Well, play games like this too much, so I gotta definitely get used to them. I gotta learn the factors and everything. So we learned that, um, you definitely gotta look around when it comes to, like, buildings. Because I didn't even notice that ladder. I was looking for, like, rubble. I'm so used to, like, shooter games, there's usually, like, a roof rubble. Just having, like, a slope I can run up to. I was looking for stairs. I need to learn that there are ladders as well. Like the whole slide thing we ran into. I also need to remember where I kill enemies as well. We also gained a level up, so that's the thing that we need to know. And some guns like I expected do alarm enemies so yep I called it Ooh, and gears give HP as well I'm going to give that to you because I'm going to be using you as more of a distraction as for items I can throw hand grenades destroys covers so yeah, you're gonna be my main assault. And it occurs that you leveled, <laughs> even though you were dead, but hey. <laughs> it's fine. It's good that we tested that he um, revives afterwards. The permadeath was a thing that you would definitely not get the characters back. I guess you can hire more characters. That's my first guess. Just for like more different gameplay. Is scrap over here? Yeah, no, no scrap. We're, we're fresh out of scrap. Fine. Fine, I didn't need my scrap anyway. I always gotta check over just to see if my face cam is still going. Just because I never know, because I, I have forgotten before to turn back on my face cam before. That's definitely a thing that's happened multiple times before. Okay, so no more loot. From what I can see, up oh, there, my seat. Like I said, I always gotta look around just to make sure. But yeah, basically no more loot. Let's go into 
the elevator. I have to double check. second to lose the mission's too important our mission he says is a man and that man is Hammond everyone oh, in the ark knows Hammond respects him he's our lead gearhead going farther into the zone than anybody else bringing back the machines that help us survive he knows how to keep those machines running how to fix them when they fall apart Hammond keeps the Ark's heart beating. The Elder says three nights ago, Hammond took his team of stalkers and headed north, not telling anyone why. They haven't come back. I've never seen the Elder this shaken before. It scares me. He tells us Hammond has a remote cabin in the north that could yield some clues to his location. Me and Ducks never patrolled that far before. But the Elder says he has faith in us. He believes in us. So, this mission we accept. Go to Hammond's cabin. Search for clues. Then find Hammond and bring him back alive. The fate of the Ark depends on it. Alright. I never get why people do such random special crap <laughs> like you know going out without telling anyone is probably the worst case scenario i just want to surprise them with what i bring back that no no because then that just worries everyone and then they won't expect uh how long you're gonna be back okay so we got a pretty much a good layout here uh let's see it's actually really interesting i was expecting us to like walk around and everything that'd be pretty cool all right, let's see what this is first. Want to know how this goes down? For the right price, I fix and upgrade your shitty gear. Any questions? Rude. My gear is not all that shitty. What do you mean? <laughs> so I can dismantle anything that I probably won't use. I can put a scope. Nah. I already know who I'm gonna give that to. Put on that scope. Oh, and it actually shows the weapon design. Dude, that's that's so sick. I like it. And fire stuff. Mmm. That could also be pretty good for him too. Cause so far, uh, Duck has been impressive. So I don't have any more parts for you yet. Bye. So those are things I have to collect. No, I didn't. Oh well, I guess I guess that was How's it. it to be honest. So can I take these things off at any time or are they just permanently stuck seems like they're just permanently stuck well that's unfortunate <laughs> that's very unfortunate unfortunate you can level them up too with um, these little upgrade points too for the weapon parts but I don't have enough to upgrade that so what's up with this place after a killer day in the zone you know you can always come to Prips for some high quality grog. You want to get huh? loaded? Order a shot. No butane, no bleach, only natural ingredients. I also dabble in a little uh, antiquity trading. So if you find any cool artifacts out in the wasteland, bring them to me and I might give you something in return. Comprende? Yeah, I comprende. Comprende. Okay, let's see. Extend the group's bleed out time. That that would be nice. I think I would like to. Um, I think the thing that will benefit us the most is the cell decrease, just so we don't have to use too much resources. Then we could extend into this. But yeah, <laughs> that'd probably be best for us right now. Alright, so we'll go to Elder last. Let's go over here. You know the drill. Stalkers want gear that keeps them alive. I, Iridia, provide the gear. 
at a certain amount of price. If like, just let me know. There is one rule. Don't ever, ever pull my chain. If you pull my chain, I'll feed your ding-dongs to a zone no. wolf. Got that? Oh, whoa. Oh, okay. Yeah. Beautiful. Yeah. Happy shopping. Uh, all right, cool. <laughs> you don't have to tell me twice. <laughs> all right, so these probably would, like, been way higher. Well, not, like, way higher. Probably would have been, like, pretty decently high if I would have thought that. Yeah, let's buy two make it. Don't really have enough for anything else yet. Let's go visit the elder, see My what's up with him. Will always be a haven to you, brave stalkers. After your journeys, pay me a visit. And I'll offer you some guidance. Perhaps a story. A story. To help you become wise and strong. So basically come back for you for quests. Goodbye, stalkers. <laughs> yeah, well, I just feel like a creep now. <laughs> but yeah, guys, that's exactly where we're going to end it off. Um, so far, first impressions, really interesting. I am actually really enjoying this. But like I said last time, um, if you guys want to... Wait, will I automatically go to this? Okay, yeah. So there's not like, hey, you gotta travel through here, travel through here, travel through here, just to go back or anything like that. You can actually pick the zone you wanna go straight to. Okay, actually pretty nice. But, yeah, like I said, if you guys wanna, um, if you guys want me to do this as a YouTube series, I can. If you guys want me to do this as a um, Twitch series and upload it to YouTube, I can do that also. So I'm gonna put a poll on the community tab or you guys can tell me in the comments with that said i will see you guys on the next one until then peace out it's gonna get better real soon don't let anyone tell you what you should do i got a clear view we're gonna make it soon just keep pushing through you're what you got to lose you're what you got to lose you're what you got to lose you got to lose.